Beauty of the Queen. Wow. Once upon a time, there was a kingdom named Anima French. The kingdoms king and queen were the kingdoms queen and king were very polite with everyone, and they loved their kingdoms people too. And queen, uh, queen was very beautiful. Her eyes always shine like a diamond, and it cannot be interpreted with anyone. So, and they have a ch uh, their child also. Uh, his name was Nail, and he was only just five months old. They were celebrating the birth of their uh, <coughs> child. Uh, they were celebrating the birth of their child and and they called all all the people of their kingdom uh, and as one which was there who was very jealous with the beauty of that uh, queen mm -hmm. uh, and he was uh, she was just passing from out and she uh, saw all the people very happy and very happy so she uh, she uh, she was very jealous again that why they are very happy so she went inside and ruined everything she was just about to kill their son also the queen's and king's son then the queen shouted don't please pl please don't kill my son in place of his life please t uh, take me so um, the witch thought for a while and she the witch thought for a while and she And she told, uh, she she gave the queen a curse that curse that you when your child would be will be of fun one one year you would be on bedridden and bedridden and and his, her beauty will also go to pitch. Okay. Mm. Mm. And it was time when, the, uh, when after one year, after one year, uh, the child was about to be one. Uh, he, she, he was uh, about to be one year, and everyone was sad that she will be. Uh, she will no more be beautiful now. Yes, and and then the king was praying to God that please help me, please help me. Then the fairy was. Uh, crossing from nearby, she, uh, she saw everyone very sad. So she came. Uh, she was finding what, uh, how, why they are sad. So um, she saw the king praying. She, uh, she asked the king, "Why you are sad? Tell me, I will help you." So, uh, so the king told whole story to uh, about the curse, about the curse and everything. Then the, uh, then the fairy told queen. Uh, to king that uh, bring your uh, bring queen so she, uh, she came queen and fairy told that give me your hand i want to see so she told afterwards when your child will be big enough to go alone go alone so you uh, the king should tell the child what uh, what is what what is about her mother and how her mother About her mother, and he will go to a magical forest, and from there he will bring some leaves, which will help. Queen. The child will go to the magical forest. Yes, when he will be, uh, he will grow. Up. I like magical forests. <laughs> okay. Then he, then he has gone to ma magical forest and bring those leaves. Then he was grown up and put under the pillow of the queen. And then. Then the uh, then then the then the queen uh, queen waked up and her, her beauty also came back and the witch wa the witch was very jealous and how and marvelled like uh, how she has got her beauty and like that so uh, so that's then yes they lived happy. Okay, now tell me one thing. This story can't be Did you make it yourself? Yes. Very good. Very good. It's very a fairy tale. Though again, it needs a lot of this thing. You also made this story yourself? Yes. Excellent. 
Okay, now both of you. Pucho, beach ke questions. Or any one of you in ko. Doubts. Why did the sun have to like go to the magical forest and that? Because the fairy said that the sun will have to go to the magical forest and bring some magical leaves and put it underneath the pillow of the mother, mother. and then she will not lose her beauty. Yeah. But I have a question. You said the witch had said that she had put that curse on the queen that when your son will be one year old. So, how did a one year old child go to the forest? Yeah. The one year child and one up. year, uh, he will not go when he would be of one year. The if he, uh, When he would be of one year, at that time the queen would be... Uh, would be okay, child. okay. So, when the child was one year, the queen went ugly. And then there was sadness in the kingdom and then the fairy was crossing. Is that right? And then she, the fairy told the king that once your child grows up, then you go to the jungle and bring those leaves. Not the king will bring, the child will bring. When he and the bring. child will bring. So how many years after that did the child go? Hmm. For how many years did the queen remain ugly? And bedridden. And bedridden. Ten? Ten. So the oh. child was 11, 10, uh, 11, 11 years old. 11. Mm -hmm. yes. Oh, very interesting. But this is a fairy tale. Fairy tales are like this, huh? There's many ups and downs in this. Mm. What will happen? I love magical forests <laughs> and fairies. And you can add something in magical forest. Mm. Some beasts and some other characters, yeah. you know. You could have added have that. You, have you ever uh, read uh, Grimm's fairy tales? The fairy tales by Grimm brothers. No? Or Russian fairy tales. Mm. You should read. They are like this. You know, usme ek kaan se aadmi ghusta hai, dusre kaan se nikal jata hai ghode ke. You go in the horse's ear from one side and get out from the other side when becoming very beautiful and very handsome and smart. Hey, Things like I that. want to enter one ear and then come, come out of the other ear becoming very beautiful and handsome.